Welcome to the EMC VNX How To Session. This video demonstrates how to reset a password for Clarion or VNX Array. This is in reference to support solution article, EMC 280425. This video demonstrates how to reset a password for Clarion or VNX Array. In this session we are using Windows 7 to create a PPP connection. First we identify the communication port. Click Start. Right click on Computer. Click Properties. Click Device Manager. Verify communication port drivers are installed. And you can see the communication port details. In this example, we use communication port 4. Close Device Manager. Create Null Modem for communication. Click Start. Click on Control Panel. Click on Phone and Modem. Select Modems tab. Click Add. Check the option. Do not detect my modem. Click Next to continue. Select the option. Communications cable between two computers. Then click Next. Select the communication port as identified in the device manager. Then click Next to continue. Click Finish to end the wizard. Duly created modem is seen here. Click OK to close this window. Create dial-up connection. Click Start. Click on Control Panel. Click on Network and Sharing Center. Click on Set up a new connection or network. Select Set up a dial-up connection. Click Next to continue. Select Communications Cable between two computers. Enter the required details. Type any numeric value in the dial-up phone number. Type username as Clarion. And password as Clarion Bang. Ensure this username and password are EMC confidential and should not be disclosed. Select, remember this password. Type desired connection name. Click connect. Click skip. Configure dial-up connection. Click Change Adapter Settings. Select and right-click on newly created dial-up connection. Click Connect. Click Properties. Click Configure. Select Maximum Speed as 115200. Ensure Enable Hardware Flow Control and Enable Modem Error Control are selected. Click OK. Select Options tab. Click PPP Settings. Ensure. Enable LCP Extensions and Enable Software Compression Options are enabled. Click OK. Select the Security tab. Select the options as shown. Select Networking tab. Uncheck the option Internet Protocol version 6. Select and click the Internet Protocol version 4. Click Properties. Click Advanced. Ensure. User default gateway on remote network option is checked. Click OK. Click OK to apply the setting. Click OK again. Click on Dial to establish PPP connection. Create a new global administrator account. Open Internet Explorer browser. In the address bar, type HTTPS 192.168.1.1 slash setup. Hit Enter. The setup page will open without asking for the credentials, as we have established PPP connectivity with the Clarion. Click on Create New Account. To create a new global administrator account to log into Unisphere. Enter the new username and password to log into Navisphere or Unisphere. 
Then click Apply Settings. Click back to go to main page. Click Log Out. Log into Unisphere. Launch Unisphere from Internet Explorer browser. In the address bar type HTTPS 192.168.1.1. Hit Enter. Enter newly created credentials. Click Log In. Logged in with newly created user. Click Domain. Click Manage Global Users. Select the user you wish to change the password. Click Modify. Type and confirm new password for the selected user. Click OK. Click Yes to confirm. Click OK to close this window. Click Log Out. Log in to Unisphere with user whose password has been reset. Log in as admin whose password has been reset. Click Log In. Logged in as admin whose password has been reset. 